All right, here we are back with another monster quick tip. This time we're looking at Pro Tools and relinking media files with your session. So let's open up our test project session today, which is relinking media files. So our file has been moved, and what happens automatically is we get this pop-up for a missing file. We can automatically find and relink, which is the easy way. Usually works pretty well, pretty quickly. We can manually look for it and relink it, or we can skip it all. For today's tutorial, we're just going to skip it because I want to show you from inside a session how to find that window and relink. So right now our file is offline as you can see. So what we want to do is go up to Window and we want to go to New Workspace, Default, and we want to go to our Pro Tools session and Audio Files. Now in this Audio Files folder is where our media should be, but it's currently not linked. So what we need to do is right click and choose Relink. And you can actually choose, I'll close this window, you can actually choose Relink Offline and the same window will open up. So this is the Relink window that you normally will get if you choose to manually relink your media uh, as what happened at the opening of the session, but we chose not to do that. All right, so in here we have three different window areas. We have our Explorer window. We have our middle window here, which is going to show all our files that we need to find. And our bottom window here will actually put the candidates for committing a relink to. So let's go ahead and dive down and find our file that we want to have, which is buried in here. And we can actually spread these windows out so we can see and read everything. And I simply moved it outside of a folder. So this is where the file is. And what you can see is our unique name ID, our unique ID in Pro Tools, matches our file to be relinked. And another thing you can see is it gives you the size of the file, gives you the pathway that it might be in. And if it has a WAV file, allows you to play it back. And if you had relinked here, you could play it back here as well. So let's go ahead and click uh, check mark on this folder because we want to search in this folder. Now we're going to left click on our file to be relinked and then right click on it. And then we're just going to highlight our file to be relinked. Now we're going to come down here and click find all candidates and it found our candidates. So we're going to click this little window here and this icon of the relink shows up for all three windows because we're going to relink this file, the actual media file in the Explorer window to the project media file. And when that looks correct, it plays right there as well too. And what we're going to do is come up here to the window, Commit Links. And we're going to click on this button, choose Yes, and then we're going to close this window and this window. And here is our file right back where it was. And that's a monster quick tip on how to relink your media files within a Pro Tools session. Hope this was a helpful tip for you. If it was, please subscribe and feel free to share. Remember to follow us on Facebook and Instagram under Cape Cod Sound School. Also, subscribe to our channel on YouTube.